We begin with an event that features fun activities for the entire family. It's a block party put on by local groups that aim to build a better community. Here now with how the Salvation Army Adult Rehabilitation Center is making a difference by helping put on this event. We have Lieutenant Lavelle Butler. Welcome. Hey, thank you. We're so excited to have you here. Um, oh, I'm excited to be here. <laughs> First off, okay, Salvation Army, you have the Adult Rehabilitation Center. Correct. What is that all about? Well, you know, we house 107 uh, men and women. Wow. Well, and so how the program works is someone calls in, they actually say they need, a, need something picked up, a donation. Mm -hmm. Right, so we send a truck out to go get that donation, and they bring it back to our warehouse. And the men and women in the program, they actually sort through the donations, help helping us put a price on them, send them back to the store, and a portion of the proceeds comes back to the center, making the program free for men and women. Wow, so it's a full circle yes, type of thing. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And yes, a lot of that's at the thrift shop you guys also yes. have. That's where we it have goes. we have uh, four thrift stores, mm -hmm. uh, one on Blackstone, one in Shaw. Uh, one in Maine downtown and one in Visalia. Oh wow, yeah. so that's a big difference. So people can go shop there and mm -hmm. those proceeds will go back towards the rehabilitation Correct. center. Uh, uh, your purchase saves lives. That's incredible. Think about it. Yeah, yeah. it's a big difference in people's lives. Well, and you guys are throwing an event coming up. Oh yes, I mean, yes, it Saturday. Amazing. This is gonna be exciting. This is gonna <laughs> be exciting. So we've partnered with several uh, vendors in the community uh, JD Foods and Cisco, a lot, of, a lot of different food vendors, and they're actually going to donate some food for us. The police department's going to come out and they're going to cook the food for us. Oh, right? nice. Enjoyable, right? <laughs> Always cooked. Yeah. And we're going to have a bounce house, we're going to have train rides, we're going to have a petting zoo, oh. we're going to have a dunk tank. Come on now, you need to be in a dunk tank. I, uh, I don't know about the dunk tank. <laughs> mm -hmm. But we're going we're gonna to have a good time. <laughs> and you know what? The first hundred kids that come get a free backpack. That's incredible. Every hour we're going we're gonna to raffle off uh, four gifts for the kids and the family members there. This block party is just to give back to the community. Absolutely. That's all we want to do. We want to give back to the community and show to the community and show them that we're there and we care. Absolutely. And this event's completely free, correct? Completely free. It doesn't cost anything. What do you hope people get from this event when they leave at the end of the day from this? Well, during the event, we're going to have some testimony of the men and women that are in the program. Mm -hmm. So they're going to share their, their life and their life experience through the program. But also, uh, we know that Salvation Army is a church. And we also want people to know that we're trying to share the true love of Christ through the community, through love and sharing. We want them to know that we're there and we care. Yeah, for sure. How much does this event and this program I mean, mean to you guys? This is a huge thing. Well, you know what? Um, it means a lot because we couldn't, we couldn't be where we are and do what we do without the community. So we want to give back and show the community that we care too as well. And that's why it's free to everyone. And you have a lot of community uh, partners in this event too. We do, we do. Uh, several, they're gonna come out and they're gonna have tables and, and the vendors, they're gonna come out and just hand out their free items or, or, their, or their information to uh, uh, bring more information or awareness to those in the community that are missing information that, that just sometimes doesn't get to them or just goes right by them. So it's gonna be able, a way to communicate to them to provide uh, outlets or, so they can get services that they need in the community. Absolutely. Sometimes it's just a little thing like this that can make a really big difference in it someone's really family. It really is. The Rehabilitation Center, mm -hmm. how does this work for someone who may need to come for some services? Well, all you do, you make a, uh, we have a phone number, it should come up, mm -hmm. and you call. You call, you call intake department and, and she'll talk to you. Uh, and what she'll do is she'll do a small assessment to see uh, if you're truly uh, able and you're ready to come to this particular program. Our goal is to get you in the program, uh, get, you, get you all cleaned up, get you sober, get you in there, and get you started to thinking about changing your life. Mm -hmm. If we can get you to change your, the way you think, right, then we can think, get you to change your heart, and then you can see life differently. And you won't look back and look at things so tragically if you look at the positive things. And we do know that uh, uh, at the Salvation Army, we talk about having a relationship with the Lord, and that's truly important because we believe uh, that's one of the, the main foundation for many people in recovery. We also implement the 12 steps of Narcotics and Alcoholics Anonymous. And we know those two things graphed together, men and women continue to get saved and stay focused on recovery and their lives are changed. Yeah, it's incredible what in you this guys community. Do. And in the community, community can give back with this event, which is huge. They can. And they can. where is this event happening? What time? How does this all work? Right. We're right, down, we're right downtown. Uh, we're off parallel, 804 South Parallel. And we're right off um, the Main Street right there. I forget what it was. Oh, gosh. 
<laughs> we'll so, have it up there, too. Yeah, we'll have it up there. Anyway, <laughs> so, so, the so you come down 804 South Parallel. You come down there, there 10 o'clock, 10 to 2. 10 to 2. 10 to 2, and we'll, we'll probably a little, little longer. But come out there, and we're just hoping to just share the love of Christ and, and um, uh, show the community we care. That's all we plan to do. Oh, that's incredible. A little recap. So what is everything you're going to have? Food and all uh, We're going to have food, a bounce <laughs> house, train, a petting zoo, horses. Oh, gosh. We're going to have a little game section. We're going to have a, a huge obstacle course bounce house. Oh, and then we're going to have a small so bounce house cool. for, for the little ones because we know we got little ones, right? Of we'll course. have it for them. And they don't want them to get hurt. And we have games that everyone wins, right? We want everyone to awesome. play and win a game. And <laughs> it's still not going to cost them anything. Perfect. Nothing at all. But you do get to dunk someone. You got to come down, right? Oh, yeah. It sounds amazing. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much hey, for coming and joining you. us. This thank sounds amazing. And thank you for everything you guys are doing. Thank you.